greet you all beautiful people of Ghana and beyond. I hope that you all are doing amazing. Hey, Pacho. Today we are going to sweat draw. Sweat go, baby. Sweat go in the building. Boy, be like, who they worry past for Ghana? Which region worries the most? Ashanti. The Ashanti region. Ah, they will be on you. Hey, check this one in. Kumasi, check this one in. Hey! But Swedro row people say they are not smiling. I have gotten so many requests to take a look at Swedro. A lot of you don't know that Swedro is like my hometown, right? You, you don't know that I passed through Swedro to go to my hometown. You don't know in Ghana. Well, one day we'll talk about it. But for now, let's just focus on showing you guys this amazing school. I hope that you all are doing amazing. I appreciate you for keeping up with me on this series. And today, like I said, let's go to the central region and take a look at Swedro. And I will be back. Let's go.
I've seen so many videos on YouTube here. I've seen videos of alumi aluminites com coming back to give back to the alma mater. But I've, ne I've never seen this type of energy. Swedro own is on another level. These people are giving, like they are giving so much. I know that some schools do this. Some alumis do this. But you don't, um, you don't film it. You have to film it and post on the internet. Not for a show off. Just do it like that. Okay, because that is going to be strength for another. It's going to be like a challenge for another school to say, okay, oh, we too, we have to give back. Suezco alumni are on a different level. Let's go and check them out. It's, 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 a long, it's a long thing. These people have given so much to their alma mater. Let's go check them out and I will be back. Let's go. So, the draw is for the media. This girl, give up me and my friend, one of my best friends called Emmanuel Abeka. He is based in the United Kingdom. So we came together to, to it's a, he was also a PC 93, house one. House one. Right. So we bought this one for the media team so that they two can use it as well. And so what we have happening here now, I want to let you know the items involved in the donation. And so we are speaking of 46 pieces of system units. Wow. We are talking of the same number for monitors. Wow. We have two um, Wi-Fi routers. Servers. They brought three projectors as well. And then we have 43 keyboards. We have 75 pieces of mouse. And then we have speakers, 24 of them. And then we have two printers. Wow. And then we have one camera drone. Wow. And that is what he was saying that for that one, he and then another PSA, PSA Abaka, who is in the UK, the same year group 93, they came together to secure the drone for agenda because we have been so many So they got it specifically for the school for agenda team and so it means that we'll be seeing so more of agenda we haven't finished there is two projector screens as well we also have 24 pieces of computer memory we have assorted books literature science about 140 pieces and then we have a laptop bag and then a projector bag as well and so you know we have to bring samples here because you can see the things are so many and so the remaining are the stores we will um, ensure that we have um, to it that we will emboss and then at the end of the day will be able to use and you see when we talk of ICT it means that each and every student is going to benefit yes. because you know ICT we have the core and then we have the elective and so it means that for the items that they have brought each and every one the printers will use it to print your reports for your parents <laughs> and then they'll know what you are doing yes and so I want to stand on behalf of the school board, management, staff, students, and all well wishers of the school to express our deepest gratitude that they have thought about the needs of the school and this is what they have also decided to bring on board. And we want to assure them 
that these things that they have brought on board will definitely help the students as well as the teachers because we are talking about teaching and learning and we are very hopeful that this would inspire the students to learn make more breakthroughs and at the end of the day in some time soon to come they would also be standing here donating to those who will be in the system we want to say that god richly bless you and your folk wherever it is that you got these resources from we pray that the lord should bless in thousand fold so that as oliver twist what do we do we ask for more we thank us so much for doing us this honor through our PACS, our, in fact, our honorable PACS presence over here. We actually don't have a lot to say, and the only thing we can tell you guys is the only thing we can tell all of you here is God bless you. All. We are so, so grateful for everything you guys have done for us today. And all we can say is may God continue to do more and more for you first. First, gain more from you as well. Thank you so much. For the closing prayer, we take the school boat. When we say Oliver asks for more, it means that already they have thought of it that oh, yeah. more will be coming. And so we are using this opportunity to let others know that this is what some are doing. Therefore, it's a good thing to do. It lessens our burden, especially the management and then the staff here when we have the equipment and the apparatus to use for activities it makes the work yeah. <laughs> on behalf of the school board management staff and students we want to express uh, heartfelt appreciation to the 1975 year group especially the four donors who have decided to adopt the, the music unit as well as the key unit in fact um we don't only talk of the curricular activities the extra curricular activities are also very important and of course those are the areas that some of the students um, find their favor from and so it means that with this they are going to improve whatever activities that go on in those two units and we are very grateful to them um, we are very happy that they are saying that this kind of presentation that we are seeing will be in phases oh, and yeah. so it means that when we say 
Oliver asks for more, yeah. it means that already they have thought of it. That oh, yeah. More will be coming. This money we have gathered here. Yeah. This will go a long way at least to save some time for them to uh, hurry to their feeding and also to help the kitchen staff um, in putting together everything. So, uh, these are something small that Swiss School A level 95. We are going to give to the school to support and to let you know that we are always available. Anytime you call on us, once we can, in fact, we make the effort at least to do what we can do to support. There are so many other videos of the alumis coming back to give back, but I can't show up because it's going to be one long video, and I don't think you guys have time to sit down and watch all that. Like these guys are giving so much, and let me tell you, if you have not given to your alma mater, please do so before I get to your school. But it will be fair that you remember your alma mater. Okay, if other people are not calling on you to say let's go give be that person to call them okay some people just don't remember and some people just do not know how to make the move but when you call them they respond okay so i hope that you are giving see how Swe swesco are doing it swesco are not playing wow all right so we're going to go back to the school as we have always done and tour the entire place and i will be back let's go <music>
honestly there is no single school in ghana that is left out there is no single school in ghana that is left out see accra academy that is located right in accra i thought maybe accra academy would be more than other schools in the outskirts of accra i mean the ones are in other region but after touring some of the schools i have taught so far i think there is fairness i can't say this is fairness because they are the same and i love this so much please continue you see fairness and justice is all that will set the future free because look at swedro swedro for those of you that for people that do not know where swedro is i know swedro swedro is not that far from accra like that all right but certainly is not in accra if i can talk about where i come from i would have say swedro is somewhere like somewhere like Ore in my own country if i'm allowed to say where i'm from like it's away from the city away from the major city it's a big town densely populated i know but you wouldn't you would think okay oh the schools here will be bigger than that no they are all the same and i love it you guys i'm, I'm going to the north very soon there are so many schools in the ashanti region there are so many schools even in cape coast there are so many schools every corner and i'm taking a look at one after the other all you have to do is be patient temanko i will come to tema don't worry i'm everywhere i'm for everybody so but i hope that you enjoyed this video and that i will see you guys in another one ciao